Okay, I'm doing this for my mom. I'm going to show you how to zoom in and out like the way the pros do. And by the way, this is Power Director 16. Now you notice the two clips in the timeline? I'm going to show you what it looks like uh, without the zoom in on it. And that little second clip I got there is going to play a big part. Because when you, when you zoom back out, you don't want to have a train wreck when you go back into your regular video. So that's the difference between the pros and the amateurs. I'm going to show you that. So see, when you zoom back out in your regular video, you don't even want the person watching to even realize that you zoomed in and zoomed out. And if it ain't doing right, your viewers will notice the transition flaw. So I click on my clip, I want to turn blue, and then I click Power Tools, and then I'm going to go right here on the side, and I'm going to select Crop and Zoom. Okay, and then that brings this up. Now here's the secret. Let my clip play all the way to the end. You can let it play, but I just moved my slider. And see the double diamond there? I clicked on that. And I'm clicking duplicate previous pre keyframe, which is the very first frame that's on the video. So see, now I'm going to go back to the very first of the video, and I'm going to play it again. Play it to a spot to where I want to zoom in. And see, now I'm going to the single diamond that's got a plus sign, and I want to add a keyframe right there. And now I'm just grabbing the little key marks and putting the frame what I want it to zoom to. And then I'm going to click play again. And, and what I want it to do is hold that zoom there for like, you know, just a few seconds. And then, and then I'm going to go back and click duplicate the previous frame. Okay, so now I'm going to show you the clip. Plus the little second clip so you can see it zooms right back out without having a train wreck. It's a little bit herky-jerky because I can do this faster than what the computer can process it. But if I'd have waited a minute, it would be just as smooth as silk. And I do when I make my YouTube videos. Check that out right there. Now, see what I mean? It played right on into that, that second clip there. And you never even notice the transition effect. Ah, right, everybody, that's how to crop and zoom like a pro.